guys all know Ron. Ron also has an ear that needs to be cleaned out, so we'll do that. This is kind of like a two-part. People might see uh, one episode and then see another one. Yeah. One with freezing your uh, actinic keratosis and another one with digging out your ear. Where are you? Oh, Ron. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Now one thing, it's kind of hard to see past the hairs. You're laughing about the hairs. But even if I could get past them, all I'd see is just... Well, let's try it again. Am I hurting you? No. Well, let me try harder then. Put this here. And then have you hold it from the side or the front, just so I can get all the way in. And then turn your head toward your wonderful bride. I need to be able to get in really close. I'll pull your ear back a little bit. And then I'm going to grab the thing again. Okay, here we go. You ready? Yep. Okay. If I can operate the switch. That's it. I didn't get anything. <laughs> Not with the first one, apparently. Mm. Oh, well, we got some progress. I can see your eardrum now. <laughs> well, I guess that's a good thing. That worked really well. Uh, I'm going to do it the same way. I'm going to first get this in position. Turn your head that direction. That allows me to really get this in in a good spot. This is tight. And then I'll bring this in after the fact. And then we'll go. Oh, almost done here. All right, now what do we have? Oh, yeah. But I have to... I'm going to have to move that stuff around. To... It's broken through, it's just we got to clean up is all. Let me turn it the other way. Okay, turn your head... Uh... There you go. Even more if you can. All right. So this allows us, you might want to be over where I am so you can see past this even further possibly. Get that whole long thing out. Not a huge prize, but I'm going to try to use the magnifying glass if I can. Okay. You're making a face. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just for a moment, I'm going to use this guy to take a peek in there. pushed in the way of are you guys able to see that so Ron you did look on YouTube and see yourself didn't you oh, sure. did you see all those nice comments yeah did you comment back there it is no I didn't let's take a look in there so what we see is an eardrum that is now uh, you're able to see it, although it's not it's not clear like a, uh, you like to see in an eardrum. It looks like you've had some congestion, possibly. Um, also, having all that stuff washed up against it just now kind of caused some of the, uh, the cloudiness of it. So, Ron's ears are, are now both totally open for, for sound to get in, 
although there's just a little flake of wax remaining on both of them, we leave that alone because if we were to go digging to get all that out, would cause abrasions and injury. And, and the wax actually does play a role in the ear to protect it and to keep stuff out. So we, we just go so far with cleaning. And patients get better outcomes when we do that. If you have problems with the ears getting kind of plugged up, and instead of it getting to this point, what you can do is use an over-the-counter earwax softener. Yeah. Use that a couple times a week for a couple weeks, and that generally will take care of it. And, and we can check it if we need to. And we always have the backup of using the, the irrigator if we need to. Mm -hmm. Hey, thanks for joining us. Until next time, this is Ron and Dr. Mark Vaughn telling you to subscribe and stay in good health.